Watch this before you even start playing Lords of the Fallen. Essential tips that are going to help you from making the wrong choice. And then on top of that information that we already know what's going on and what's coming for Lords of the Fallen. As you will be playing through the game, there is one very important thing and that is the Umbrum Lamp. I know you've heard about it and you know a lot about it. There is one particular thing that this Umbrum Lamp is going to do besides so solving different type of puzzles if you do not do this when you are fighting bosses you're going to definitely miss on a lot of rewards and that is when you take a boss completely down and he's dead and he's out you need to do a soul's flame by doing this you're going to be able to rip the entire rewards that they're going to be able to drop so if you are looking at your inventory and you're missing that weapon that that boss didn't didn't drop for you it is because you did not not do a soul's flay that is why it's so important that when you are running around and playing lords of the falling you need to upgrade that lamp by upgrading the umbra lamp you're going to be able to get more souls plays so you are ready so when you're defeating all those 30 different bosses you're going to reap all the rewards that they're going to drop by doing a souls play next are going to be all the different type of status effects that you're going to be able to use and also that are going to affect you in a negative way there's going to be bleed burn frostbite ignite poison smite and also wither all those different type of status effects are, you're going to be able to inflict on enemies and bosses and the same thing is going to be for you there you're going to be inflicted by them but there's also a cure for all of those different type of status effects and then on top of that you're going to be able to infuse all the different weapons that you're going to be able to grab find or purchase as you are going in through lords of the fallen and you're going to be able to infuse them with all those different type of status effects now the game comes with 13 different type of classes that you're going to be able to play but there's four secret ones but there's actually only three those three different classes are going to be able to unlock only if you choose the correct ending in your next ng plus so you're going to be able to play this three more additional times by unlocking all those different classes now the four secret one is the one that you purchase which is the dark crusader which is comes with a deluxe version overall the game is going to give you 13 different classes that you're going to be able to use and one of the most essential tips that i can give you is going to be when you are doing damage on all the different bosses and also all the different type of foes that you're going to be fighting there's going to be three different type of damages that you're going to need to pay very close attention when you're fighting them that is going to be red white and gray red is when you're hitting above damage you're doing more damage on any enemy me or any boss when you're hitting white that means you are doing below damage meaning that you're either under power under leveled or your weapon is not strong enough and that is why it's very important when you guys are unlocking all those 194 different weapons and shields that when you are fighting all those different type of bosses that are either going to drop you spells they're going to drop you maybe one of the 339 armor pieces that you're going to be able to find throughout the whole entire game that if you are doing white damage that means you are under level gray means that the boss is immune to the elemental damage that could be either burn frostbite poison or wither any those different type of status a boss or an enemy can be immune to it so knowing right away what you need to do during the game to be able to do a different type of damage so that is what you're going to have at your disposal 194 weapons and 76 spells and catalysts that you're going to be able to unlock so knowing all these essential tips are going to save you a lot of time when you are fighting foes and enemies in lords of the fallen if this video was very helpful to you a like is appreciated subscribe turn notifications to all as we will be bringing to you more lords of the fallen videos coming your way